Hello guys, in this video, I am going to discuss about the relationship between void ratio and porosity. Okay, so first of all, we all know that the notation for void ratio is E. That means void ratio is denoted by E and porosity is denoted by N. So, what do you mean by void ratio? It is the ratio of volume of voids to the volume of solids. Okay. Next, what do you mean by porosity? Porosity n is equal to volume of voids divided by whole volume. Okay. So, this is the equation. This is the equation for E and M. And now, we are going to relate this that means we are going to build a relationship between e and n okay so here i will draw a diagram so that you can understand well this is three phase diagram in this three phase diagram file will consist of solids here and so this is water next this is air so here it is volume of air and it is volume of water and it is volume of soil particles that are solids okay next here the volume of air and volume of water combined called as volume of voids because air and the water will accumulate in the void spaces present between these solids so in void spaces some voids are filled with air and some voids are filled with water so the combined volume okay of air and the water is called as volume of voids so here we can say that volume of voids is equal to volume of air plus volume of water so now write n is equal to so porosity equal to volume of voids by volume of sorry total volume right next so total volume means so here volume of voids equal to volume of air plus volume of water okay in the same way here total volume total this is volume of solids right so here total volume is equal to total volume is equal to volume of voids plus volume of solids so I will substitute this VV plus VS in V. VV volume of voids by volume of voids plus volume of solids. Then, so I will inverse this equation. I mean, 1 by N is equal to volume of voids plus volume of solids solid by volume of voids. Okay, so here. I did inverse this equation then now so I will separate this 1 by n is equal to vv by vv plus vs by vv so here vv vv will get cancelled and 1 by n is equal to 1 plus vs by vv so here it is inverse of y ratio because so here I am writing E is equal to VV by VS okay so that can also be written as inverse 1 by E is equal to VS by VV okay is that right yeah so so from this VS by VV we can be written as 1 by E so here 1 by N is equal to 1 plus 1 by e okay so 
this is the basic relationship on between n and e okay from this we will find out n and e so so if we need n then 1 by n is equal to 1 by n is equal to i mean if we need n means if we need to know the porosity in terms of void ratio this is the formula okay so here i will get the lcm e into 1 e plus 1 by e okay so i am again inversing this equation so n is equal to e by e plus 1 okay next so i need to calculate e in terms of n so then same from this equation this will come and also this also will come so like this i will i will send this one to the left hand side so that one by n minus one plus one becomes minus one when it go around the equation next here one by e will be there so that here i will take lcm one minus n by one and one by e. here i will inverse this so that e is equal to we will get n by one minus n okay so this is the relationship between e and n very very easy this is also can be written as e by 1 plus e because here it is 1 minus n so that in the same form we can tell it 1 plus e okay so some people will confuse that here it is plus or minus okay so they do not remember properly that here it is plus or minus so that a small remembering point is here here the negative will come so that it is n so here there is n n means negative like that we can easily remember this so here n is negative means this is 1 minus n so it will be 1 minus n then automatically it is 1 plus e okay so finally we can conclude that porosity n is equal to e by 1 plus e and void ratio e is equal to n by 1 minus n this is the relationship between porosity and void ratio okay thank you guys for watching this video for more content please subscribe my channel